Stay wow. out. I don't smell weed. No, My brother don't out. smoke weed. Stay so did y'all check the neighbor's house if y'all smell weed? No, sir. Zero to a hundred. Because she knows he's clearly guilty. All right, all right, all right. Laura Fader coming back at you with another video. We're going to review some more body cam footage today. It seems like it's getting hard out here for a thief. Now, this is an oldie but goodie, and a lot of you have probably seen this. These criminal masterminds, or this criminal mastermind and his sister, are going to be very entertaining for us today, and I promise that they will be entertaining. Without further ado, I'm going to go ahead on and get started. Good, Matthew? Yes, sir. Officer Austin, what's going on? So, my bag got stolen today. Okay. Um, I wouldn't really care for it, except there's like, there's military documents in there that I need. This man said there's military documents in there. I wonder what it is that he do. Eh. Okay. So, uh, military documents? They got pinged at this house right here. I knocked on both the doors and they said they don't want anything of it. Those at this house right here, I mean, it's kind of bugged around, but... Here, her and I drove here and it's been, I don't know, I mean, I looked in the grass, maybe somebody threw out the window, but I can't find anything. And I tried to ping it and play a sound, and I can't, it's not in the grass, I can't ping it. This man right here has already done the cop's job for him. How easy is it to be police with Apple and the technology that we have nowadays? This man had pinged it, went to the house, knocked on the door. Imagine you steal something, right? And somebody come and knock at your door, <laughs> asking for it. It's kind of like when that bill man come and you ain't got the money, right? And you just sit in the house like, you know, uh, ain't nobody at the door. Let's continue. There's a, there's a food, like, binder in there. Yeah. And it has, like, my banking information, my notes, my mail, my locker. Man, banking information. Okay. I mean, it could very well just be in the garbage. Sounds like somebody that made me realize how much stuff I got on my laptop Mario? right about now. Okay. So you got the backpack here? Or the I actually don't. I have me. <laughs> that fool said he actually don't. Now keep in mind, they got a tracker on it. Neighbors, and uh, he told me that he talked to them. Okay. These neighbors over here? Or these ones? I don't know. He just he came to this house. Oh yeah, the, the air tag is, is going right here. What? Okay. At this address, it can be. That's my bag. I was my car. Oh, yeah, this is a criminal mastermind, clearly. All right. Like I said, I don't know why I would be popping up here. Like I like I said, the neighbors, any, anybody else in this area, the only one here I know what is in this house. And there's definitely no backpack in here. All right, just, uh, I might come back to chat with you. I just think that. Keep in mind, definitely no backpack in here. 5962. Can advise where any purses or brown wallets taken from these vehicles. These garbage cans are full of purses and brown wallets. Once again, <laughs> how you gonna steal stuff and then throw the purses and wallets in your own trash can? <laughs> in your own trash can. Clearly this is a criminal genius we're dealing with. This is Heath Ledger from The Dark Knight right here. There's credit cards here too. You guys are allowed to look through property hey, garbage yeah this is an extreme all right now the last video i did centered around women and i you know some people may say oh you're picking on women no see it ain't that we picking on women it's just that y'all get to the scene and escalate everything escalate why is that i understand this is her brother but watch how this lady interact with the cops Chevy running a little rough. I see y'all searching through my brother's trash can, so I'm just wondering what's going on. Well, someone's got to let me know what's going on. All right. Who want to bet? She clearly knows what's going on. She rolled up on the cops like she large in the chalk. Well, somebody's got to let me know what's going on. Oh, they going to let you know. Can you tell me what's going on? Do you live here? I come here often. No. And I drove by and see you guys searching my brother's garbage can, so I am just wondering what's going on. Okay, and well, cars out you don't, here. You don't live here, you don't need to know right now. Actually, I do. Mario, what's going on? Time for, you have enough key runner. 
actually been asking all the time since okay. I put Listen to how exasperated he is. He already know where this is going to go, right? Hold up here, so yeah, go ahead. Thank you. So, he had a bag stolen from his car last night. Had an air tag in it. Yeah. Air tag places it somewhere between these two houses. Yeah. So... You know who lives in the other houses? We're talking with them right now. We're going to go next door. But the air tag shows okay, it right here. Okay, that's fine. But don't go searching through my brother's garbage can for... Okay. Picture this. This lady arrives on the scene. I understand that it's her brother. She starts issuing orders to the police. Don't go searching through my brother's trash can. That's like telling the police, hey, go searching through my brother's trash can. You understand that, right? Y'all don't property. have the right to do that. Y'all don't have the right to do that. Well, they're doing it. Y'all know property. better than that because y'all are police officers. We don't do to, no we have like the that authority without permission. To do it. Potty mouth. Straight up. We have the authority it's really to that. search the garbage. No, you don't. Now, without my brother's permission, you don't. That's illegal in a... I can't even search my neighbor's garbage can. Potty mouth. So I know you can't search my brother's garbage can. Don't do, okay. don't do nothing like that without his permission. Thank you. Mario. Wow. It's just you? All right. I'm going to have you step out. Imagine being on a date with that right there and trying to tell her, well, that dish you're trying to order... A little bit on the high side once you pick something else. Are you have a seat for me? I'm gonna be uh, securing the residence because the residence smells like weed. We're gonna be applying for a search warrant. Is there anybody else home? Of course it smells yeah, like have weed. He been smoking. Have a seat for me right now, we'll talk about that later. Hey T shirt. Hey T shirt. Police department. Make yourself known if you're in your duty. Now he now. called to her like she can help. Hey T shirt. Y'all don't smell no weed, so y'all can get wow. out of here. Wow. Stay out. Wow. I don't smell weed. My brother Stay don't out. smoke weed. Stay did y'all check the neighbor's house if y'all smell Stay weed? Out. No, sir. Zero to a hundred. Because she knows he's clearly guilty. How is this helping him? Man, look. People, when you get caught doing wrong, shut up, sit down. That's the quickest way for you to get through the situation. I don't know when this has ever worked right here running up on the cops issuing orders and then getting amped up let, let me give you a little quiz who thinks that a these cops are going to comply with what she wants them to comply with b this guy right here gets as elevated as she is or c she wound up going to jail y'all don't have the right to do that there's no scent of weed in this house y'all want to come and smell no scent of weed in this house recording right now Does someone else want to come and smell my brother don't smoke weed so it my brother don't smoke weed yeah don't smell like weed in here stay out get out of my brother's house Woo! before i call a mother lawyer put your hands behind your back don't they all got a lawyer? Now, this is only the second video that I've done on these body cams, and I get that. Well, technically the third. Two people have yelled they have lawyers. Two people went to jail. I ain't seen no lawyer yet. Okay, that's fine. That didn't take long, did it? I have the right to do this. All they telling her at this point is to stay out of it. That's it. Then here come this brother. That's all they doing is telling them to stay out of it, right? All they have to do is stay out of it. And guess what? They probably would have cheered with them, let them go. Everybody calm down. They go get this man's item, return it to him. They probably wouldn't have even done nothing but write this guy's citation. But check this out. In the car. I'm going to get right now. back out. Because that's so weird. They just doing this late and go Call to the person's house. Y'all don't, don't have the right to search this house. Have a seat. I will. Y'all don't got to grab me up no. like that. Y'all do the not have Yes, the they do. Right now, we're securing the house. Tell them right now. Just don't be mad. Just tell them. I have the right to go in my house. This must be her little brother. He's straight up crazy to do anything this screaming harpy is telling you to do. Tell them that, Mario. Tell them that. Tell them. They do not have the right to go into your house without a search warrant. Mario, if they had the right, they would already be searching We cannot let you back. Mario's dumb. Mario, that's fine. Mario, Oh, yeah, look at them eyes. He clearly hasn't been smoking weed at all. 
Call them Mario. He said, he listen. Said, uh, Shut up and listen, boy. He didn't say so. Shut up. No, it's not a Tell support. them they do not have yeah. the right to. <laughs> Shut up. Listen and tell them. Uh, how you gonna do? Okay. To search the house without a search warrant, and then you wait. We are not searching the house. Well, you guys were just in there without his permission after we told you not to be in there. Woo! Got the neck going. Snake and a snake. Stop breaking my off, and this will be a lot. Potty mouth. Not simpler. If y'all leave, this will be soft. Potty mouth. Way simpler without y'all here. Y'all searching shit, y'all ain't got no reason to Potty mouth. You check the bathroom right Exactly. That's what we're trying to do. Go check the This dude hired in the Goodyear blimp. Y'all see they're trying to take advantage of somebody that don't even know how to move. It's a point eight. Potty mouth. Right all right, I'm stuck. I think we all know she has a potty mouth. Y'all doing too much. Mario, just sit down. Yeah, they doing too much. Because I'm not trying to get them to think that you are going to be here in handcuffs because I told them their job. You motherfuckers know the law. They know better. I shouldn't have to tell them that. And then they put me in handcuffs because I told them right for motherfuckers wrong. Like, I shouldn't even have to say that to y'all. Listen, listen, you got it. I bet she got several men, not just one, several. You brothers love that type of stuff right there. Me? Job body cameras on? Listen, no, what they Thank said you. was That's they, really they to know right now. to make sure ain't no humans in Mario, we don't even gotta say nothing else. Man. As long as don't you know, step out of, Mario, step out of your house. house. She is in charge, ain't she? Of Mario's house. Come on, man. No, 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 no. Hey, I love my sisters. But I got to tell you, if I stop by their house and the cops is doing what they do and they tell me to step back or whatnot, we'll handle it. We'll run that thing right on through the legal system. Matter of fact, I'll probably record it to make sure they do everything that they need to do. That's the way to beat them at their own game. You ain't going to come in here and bum rush them and make sure that they do what you want them to do just because you loud and vulgar. Never works. Mario, they don't have the right. Can you put it Mario. Mario, because you see they try to take me to jail because they, they Mario, they can't get into your house. The only reason they're in there is because you told him to go in the bathroom. I swear to God, Mario, if you tell them to get out the house. She clearly knows everything. I wonder if she know where she's gonna go right now. Stop resisting. Stop. Stop. Now, everybody can read that, right? After securing the area, officers find the stolen backpack of the guy that's in the car in the suspect's bathroom. Remember what he said? Oh, there's no backpack in here. There's no way it could possibly be a backpack in here. I guess that was that uh, sticky icky talking. Now I agree with that. He can record. But notice the guy's recording. But what is the young female doing? See, this is why it's a, a bad situation for the black urban community to be led by females. The matriarchy is not what we need right now. You can plainly see there are two guys on the scene and one female. She going to jail. Yeah, they having a little friction, the other two, but look at how they conducting themselves. See, I think they understand what you and I understand. If they act like she do, it's going to be another shooting. Some young black man is going to die. So what I'm trying to get people to understand is, look, we have to modify our behavior. We must make sure that our young ladies know how to conduct themselves. Everything she doing, she should be doing the opposite. She should ride by, park up there, show her brother that she's supporting him, but she should keep her mouth shut, ask the questions that she need to ask. And most of all, she should be recording everything that goes down. Probably would have been the best way to handle that. What do you guys think?
for your under arrest. arrest. You're going to get that's searched. That's fine, but under Stay. arrest for Stop one. moving. Two, sir, one, two, three. What am I under arrest Stop for? One, two, three. Are you going to tell me? is resisting. That's what you're under I'm arrest for. I'm not because I'm not moving. I'm just talking. You better be glad they don't consider your mouth as resisting and you be up under jail by now. So I'm just asking you, what up? I asked you to come over to the what car. What am I being arrested for? Why am I in handcuffs? Because you stupid. I'm gonna get in the car, bro. Please leave me alone, bro. Real talk. Get away from me, bro. What? Feminine energy. What is going on here? I'm having a hard time. Same energy she got, see? Can I talk real quick? No daddy in the house. All right, that's fine. But listen, when I can't. It's hard to talk when no one's letting me speak. Did y'all hear that? It's hard to talk when ain't nobody letting her speak. They can't stop you from speaking. That's all you've been doing since you got there speaking. What type of delusional land she living in? She must be living in that Barbie land that this new movie came. Ah, yeah, that's what, that's what she doing. She from Barbie land. The time to talk. No, Mom, no, what the back. I have the right to talk. Hot him out. Ah, y'all put me in handcuffs because y'all don't want me telling my brother that y'all don't have the right to go into his house. Yeah. That's why you're in handcuffs. Without a search warrant. But what am I being arrested for? So what am I, I being, resisting. Why am I in a handcuff? <laughs> why am I in handcuffs? Because you're not listening. Why am I in handcuffs? I don't have to listen to y'all. I think the handcuffs, the being in the back of a police car going to jail indicates that I think you kind of got to listen to them. Yes, I'm you do. woman. I can yell if I want to. You can yell if you want to. It's your party. You can yell if you want to, but uh, you weren't listening when my brother said not to go in this house for a. I don't even know. We're writing a search warrant. My brother did, told y'all not to go in his house. We have a right to freeze the scene. We're not searching. That's fine. So we're writing that's a search fine, warrant. Y'all gotta tell me what I'm in handcuffs for. You're in handcuffs because you're not listening and you're resisting for I'm resisting. Y'all wasn't trying to leave. It'll be fine. I drive by and these mother. Searching my brother's garbage can. I pull in. Why y'all searching my brother's garbage can? I ask that at least. What a nice, genteel young woman she is. Four times, neither one of the officers wanted to respond to me. He had a bag stolen from his car last night. Had an air tag in it. Air tag places it somewhere between. Of course, they explain the situation. Then I asking my brother what's going on. Then I start asking the other of. Uh, People who called the police what's going on. They get to tell me what's going on. Now he wants to butt in and tell me what's going on. Hello, y'all don't have the right to search my car. You do not have the right to search my car on my son. I will be pressing charges. That's on my son. Yep. Did you hear that? She has a son. What type of energy do you think he's going to have with a mother like that? Obviously, his father's not around, and I can tell you that to an almost certainty. Because who in the God's green earth is going to put up with this? Them octaves she just hit like the made me deaf. Explain to you what's going on, okay? I don't know a lot going on. Look at this guy now. See how calm he is? Now, yeah, it's the sticky icky. But, I mean, just look at him. Is he yelling and acting the damn fool? He the one where the stolen property was found in his house. Look how chill he is. Must you've already explained. I was just doing that, finishing it up. Showed up here, okay? The air tag was popping in, all right? Open the door, it smells like weed, okay? That gives me the right, by law, to secure the residence for the application of a search warrant, which I will be doing, okay? That means I can go inside, secure you and any persons that would be in there. The residence is secure, okay? In that cursory uh, protective sweep, we located our backpack bag. You said it wasn't that. Okay, obviously, that's an issue we will address. <laughs> yep, that's an issue we'll address. Okay, obviously, you've probably been doing some things that you're not supposed to be doing. Okay, part of how we can approach this type of issue now is I can absolutely continue to proceed and apply for that search warrant. And if the judge approves it, I'm going to search this residence. The alternative to that is, with your consent, I can also search this residence. Now, let me adjust my headphone. How many people out there think 
he could have calmly explained all that with that young female out there. They had to literally handcuff her and put her in the squad car so that they could just simply explain everything to this guy. Watch what he does though. Obviously we know we're gonna find a backpack. That's mainly what we're here for and probably could have avoided it if you would have just turned that over to begin with. See, probably could have avoided if he would just turned it over. Uh, but now we've gone obviously a little bit too far. That I'm gonna ask, will you give us consent to search your building here? Um, it just, I don't care if you guys search it, just please do not mess. I'm not gonna help you. Hear that? I don't care if you guys search it. See, see how easy that was. Now, imagine she hadn't been driving by at that particular time. Guess what? This probably would have been over. No fuss, no muss. Yeah, he probably was gonna get in trouble for stealing. But I mean, Jesus Christ. Now she going to jail for straight up nothing. Well, it ain't for nothing. Of course, everybody watched it, but you know what I mean. So Is I there any weed in there that we need to be concerned about? I have bags of clothes. I need to be laundry. I'm not concerned about laundry or anything like that, but... But I am concerned about the weed you got in there. You give us consent to search your residence here. Actually, I don't, because a responsible, a responsible person, I would rather wait until we get word from the judge. You know That's I mean? fine. Feminine energy, there it is. He done thought about it. Sister's out there, now he's doing the wrong thing. That's fine. At this point, I'm going to place you under arrest for a theft. See? Dude. Right now, I'll be applying for a search warrant. If the judge approves it, I'll be um, searching the residence. Try shutting your mouth and taking air in instead of with your mouth wide open, yelling to the top of your lung. Maybe you get better air that way. I don't know. Just a guess. Hey, can you please crack the door a little bit? Uh, can you please door. crack the door a little bit? Um, I need some fresh air and this handcuff. It was no reason for this handcuff to be on me so tight. I was not resisting. I was just yelling. I was. I put my hands behind my back for them. I was just yelling there. I don't know why this handcuff is so tight on my wrist. See, that's what happens when you apply authority. Then you get to that little cream puff that we just saw right there. All that bluster, all that fire and fury is gone after the metal handcuffs start digging into them wrists a little bit. You're uncomfortable, you can't move, and reality setting in as to where you about to go and why. So I'm just trying to organize this as best as I can for you. So. A large majority of the property from your backpack was just located on Cleveland. They'll be back at the police department uh, at some point today. No way. We need like a large majority. Of the paper, some paperwork, some. Uh, is it like quick? So like, okay. I, I wasn't given the. Scattered or is it like still in the actual? I don't know what this dude does, but it's something for the military, and he probably gonna be us garrulled when they find out about his security protocol, but I'm just guessing. Um, it sounds like a majority of it was scattered. But, but, hear me out, hear me out. There's another side to this. So while checking the residence, make sure nobody else was in there, we found your back. Um, in terms of the property, so we're currently applying for a search warrant for the house. So we have to wait for that to get your bag. So um, the property that Officer Butchkowski found will be brought up to the PD. We're working on helping you get out of here. It's just there's a lot of moving parts going on right now, and it's going to take a few more minutes, okay? Yeah, no worry. All right, everybody. I don't understand how we got here. But I do know that we need to do better than this, man. And I'm going to implore any young man out there that has a daughter. Look, don't let anybody drive you out of her life, man. She is a precious thing. She is to be nurtured, guarded, and most of all, taught how to use her energy in a correct way. So, you know, please, man, stay with your children. Uh, put up with whatever you got to put up with. First of all, guard your seed, first of all. A lot of y'all just out there sticking it in everything you can find, and that's just crazy. Guard your seed, man, because it's very important that we pass on. As you can see, 
that feminine energy she had definitely got passed on to the two young men, not to the degree that it is for her, but definitely has been passed on. We got to do better than that. And I know it sounds like preaching, but that's what I do. I'm the law of fate. I preach at you. So I'm just saying, man, uh, everybody out there, uh, I really have had a large spike in subscribers. And I want to thank each and every person that has subscribed to me. Uh, I really enjoy making videos and hopefully we'll have more content coming uh, in the future for everyone. So if you subscribe to me, I really appreciate it. If you left a comment, I try my best to answer your comments. I really want to be sort of interactive. You know, what are you guys ideas? What do you think we need to do to try and make our community better? Because I'm gonna tell you, the energy that young lady had, if you transpose that to a young man, somebody getting shot. And I know we like to say that the police is out here shooting people and stuff, but man, come on. I mean, we shouldn't be giving them any reason to, is what I'm saying. I'm not saying that everything's clean, that they don't have an agenda or a motive. I'm just saying we shouldn't be fueling the fire. I'm not going to go to a house that's on fire and throw gasoline on it. That's all I'm saying. If I throw water on it and the house burned down anyway, oh well. But I didn't contribute to it. So that's it for today, Laura Fader. I'm finna be out of here. You guys be easy. We're gonna probably go out with a song, so peace. Pain has a face. Allow me to show it to you. It's worse because you view me as an animal to be hunted now. You view me as a predator. Super at origin. You don't view me as a human being. Animalistic, that's how you act So don't be surprised when they treat you like that You don't want to work, you don't want to eat Unless you can get it out there on the street Telling your brother he can't come around Cause this is your street and this ain't your time Last time I checked, you can't afford rent But that ain't gonna stop you from laying him down Prisons are full of people like us Our ancestors looking at us with disgust Turning 360 is all in their grave Looking down at how they people behave You wanna cry victim, white man supreme Don't look at me, don't know what you mean I thought we never had lived in no cave So how did we wind up becoming the slave? Animalistic, where is your crime? Animalistic, how you get down? Animalistic, that's what they say Animalistic, if you act that way Animalistic, you locked in a cage Animalistic, prophet of rage Animalistic, does that mean you? Animalistic, belong in the zoo My people perish for what they don't know It's cause you don't try, it's not cause you slow You smart enough to out with them police Till you got locked up, now you want your release Back on the street, but now you on parole To smoke your next blunt, that's your only goal Your third baby mama is all on your ass A baby to feed, she ain't got no gas Instead of enrolling in somebody's school Out in the street, acting the fool Trying to sell the dope you don't use Working a job you say ain't for you I guess prison sex is what you prefer Outside you were him, inside you were her Performing them jobs like a hurricane Your son growing up just to do the same Animalistic, where is your crime? Animalistic, how you get down? Animalistic, that's what they say Animalistic, if you act that way Animalistic, you locked in a cage Animalistic, prophet of rage Animalistic, does that mean you? Animalistic, fell off in the zoo Animalistic, 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 animalistic. I didn't do anything wrong. You better not touch me. I'm watching this guy. Look at this guy. Don't touch me. You better not touch me. I have not broken any law. Get off of me. Get off of me. You see this guy? Yeah, they call our children animals. Like an animal.